I am Queen Elizabeth II, and this is my story, born April 21, 1926 in London, England. Former Queen of the United Kingdom and several other Commonwealth realms. My reign officially began on February 6, 1952, after the death of my father, King George VI. This has led to my distinction as the longest reigning monarch in British history, and is a testament to the many years I have devoted to the service of my country and the Commonwealth. My full name is Elizabeth Alexandra Mary Windsor, and I am the first child of the Duke and Duchess of York, who later became King George VI and Queen Elizabeth. I was privately educated and gained a deep understanding of constitutional and governmental matters from an early age, in preparation for my future role as Queen. Throughout my life and reign, I have been an observer and participant in some of the most important events in modern history. From the aftermath of World War II to the rapid changes brought about by technological advances, I traverse a world in transition. The decolonization of Africa and Asia, the Cold War, and the disintegration of the Soviet Union are just a few of the historical moments that I experienced firsthand. As the monarch, I play a vital ceremonial and symbolic role, representing the unity and continuity of the British monarchy. I have worked with many prime ministers, adapting to different political situations and providing a sense of stability amidst change. My commitment to duty and service has remained steadfast, despite the challenges and stresses of my position. One of my defining qualities is my devotion to the Commonwealth. With member states spanning every continent, this diverse and vibrant community is a testament to the enduring bonds that bind nations together. Throughout my reign, I have focused on promoting goodwill, cooperation, and development between these nations, reinforcing the idea that we are stronger together. In addition to my official duties, I have experienced personal triumphs and challenges. My marriage to Prince Philip, Duke of Edinburgh has brought stability and companionship to my life. Together we raised four children, Charles, Anne, Andrew and Edward, and nurtured the next generation of royals. Over time, I've embraced changes in society and culture, and I've realized the importance of staying relevant and connected to the people I serve. Although the monarchy is steeped in tradition, it must also evolve to reflect the values and aspirations of contemporary times. At its core, the story of my life is a story of duty, service, and dedication. I watched history unfold, played my part in shaping it, and sought to provide a sense of continuity and stability in a changing world. Through joys and sorrows, triumphs and challenges, I remain committed to fulfilling the role I was born into, a role that has allowed me to touch the lives of countless individuals and countries around the world. Thank you for listening to my story to the end. If you found it interesting, please give the video a like and subscribe to the channel for more stories.